Hello, YTPC. This is a response to the virtual giveaway for a Hobbit and Piper's 500 subscriber celebration. And uh, I'm really glad that he he put this out there because there's a film that I hadn't thought of for many years, and it just reminded me reminded me of it. And the film is Cinema Paradiso. I think it's 1988 or 1989. And I believe it won the uh, best foreign film uh, at the Oscars that year. Um, it's probably been 15 years since I've seen it, but I have watched this particular scene uh, quite a few times since then, and, and you can find it easily on YouTube. So the final scene of Cinema Paradiso is one of the most beautiful, you know, three minutes of filmmaking I've, I've ever seen. And uh, I think it, it, it gets you every time. Um, but you need a little background about Cinema Paradiso to understand uh, this, this scene. So uh, it's not a plot-driven scene, but the general story of the film is about this guy who grows up in Sicily. His name is Salvatore. And Salvatore um, is growing up uh, in the years after World War II in Italy, in Sicily. And he befriends an old man who is the projectionist at the local um, cinema. And at that time, uh, there was a kind of like the film code that we had in Philadelphia, in, <laughs> I said Philadelphia, in, uh, in the U.S., where quite a few things were prohibited. So uh, obviously profanity, obviously nudity, but even scenes of kissing were often uh, cut out of the film. So the old man, Alfredo, he has, he it's his job to uh, clip all of these censored parts of the films. Um, and, and Salvatore, the young boy, sees all these clippings on the floor and uh, I think at some point he asks Alfredo what they are, and Alfredo e explains. And uh, he always wanted to see these these clippings. So he grows up, and the film kind of tells the story of his life briefly, and it's told in flashbacks. And um, and Salvatore learns about film from Alfredo, and eventually becomes a filmmaker. And at the very end of the movie. There's a wonderful scene where Salvatore is, he hands over a reel uh, to the projectionist, and he's sitting in a theater by himself. I think I think he's returned to uh, to, to Sicily when he's maybe uh, around 50 years old or so, and he watches the all of the clips that Alfredo had had cut out of the films that he showed him. And they're all spliced together, so you get you get a kissing scene from a uh, uh, a Charlie Chaplin film that's kind of funny, where the girl kisses him and he kind of faints. You get a passionate kissing scene from some, you know, uh, uh, another movie. Um, there's a clip of a Cary Grant film where there's a kiss. So there's just it's just mostly mostly kissing scenes, and uh, but they're all different, and they're all some are funny, some are passionate, some are tender. And throughout, throughout this scene, you're listening to what I think is one of the greatest soundtracks in film history, and that's Ennio Morricone's um, love theme from Cinema Paradiso. And it's a spectacular, spectacular theme. Ennio Mor Morricone wrote the soundtrack to The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. Uh, that's, that's his work that most people are uh, uh, familiar with. So if you like the soundtrack from The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly, uh, do yourself a favor. And uh, either watch all of Cinema Paradiso or at a bare minimum, just go on YouTube and search for uh, final scene or end credits of Cinema Paradiso and you'll find it. Maybe I'll put it in the link to, uh, to this video. Um, and let me know what you think. Thanks. Bye.